The fingerprint lock is a part of Apple iPhone security, and it secures the store touch ID in the secure enclave. Any tampering with iPhone, it will render it worthless. If it's that easy, one can circumvent this security. So everyone must enable a touch ID on its phone. During the touch id setup, one pop-up panic us. And it is unable to activate touch ID on this iPhone error. Unfortunately, fingerprint scanning won't work due to multiple reasons, and I know that it bothers you. Because if you can't unlock or even unable to make purchases using Touch ID. It either a software issue or possible hardware issue like after screen replacement, home button broken, or it may be due to the after battery replacement on your iPhone. Don't worry, you're watching How to I Solve YouTube channel. If you are a first time viewer, please let's subscribe to my channel to get more facts, which I will share with my subscribers. Before getting started there are some important points that must be noted. Point 1 is that the finger and home button both must be clean and dry whenever you attempting to unlock your phone with a fingerprint. Because of certain items like moisture, lotions, sweat, oils, cuts, or dry skin might affect the fingerprint scanning system. Certain activities can also temporarily affect fingerprint recognition, including exercising, swimming, showering, cooking, or other conditions or changes that affect your hand fingerprint. Point 2 is that some of the time, your phone touch it unable to scan your finger while the phone in charging mode, so please unplug your phone and then try to use it. Point 3 is that if you're using a case or screen protector, make sure it doesn't cover the home button or the surrounding ring. Now let's begin, solution number 1 is first of all unlock your phone. Start with enrolling in the new touch ID if any touch ID exist, then remove it to do this. Follow my steps steps 1 open the settings app, Step 2 Scroll the screen tap Touch ID and Passcode. Your phone will ask to enter the passcode to go to the next page. Step 3 Now set up the new Touch ID for that tap on Add a Fingerprint. So on this page. You can see Touch ID setup instructions. Read this and follow carefully till the setup done. Let's put your finger on the home button. Lift and rest your finger on the home button repeatedly. After that adjust your grip. Keep going to capture the edges of your print. Click on Continue. Now this time lift and rest the edge of your finger on the home button repeatedly. So that you will get screen. Complete touch ID is ready. Your print can be used for unlocking your iPhone. Click on continue. That's it. After that turn off the toggle next to iPhone unlock, as well as turn off toggle next to the iTunes app store for touch ID now, restart your iPhone. I hope you know what iPhone model you have. Because different iPhone has different steps to restart next restart your phone. Use the power key. Press and hold on the power button till the slider appear. Then slide to the right side and turn off your phone. After turn on your phone. After all that, go to settings app tap on touch ID and passcode now. Turn iPhone unlock and iTunes app store toggle on green. You should add a maximum fingerprint and then try to scan your fingerprint on the home button. I hope this worked for you. If not work, then go to the next workaround. Solution 2 Force Restart Your iPhone I hope you know how to force restart your iPhone. If you don't know then text me in the comment or get a link in the video description below. If none of the work then watch continue till the end. Solution 3 Reset Network Settings This is the quick easy and fix the issue on your iPhone or iPad. Step 1 Just go to Settings. Step 2 Tap on General. Step 3 Now scroll the screen tap on Reset. Step 4 After this. Click on Reset Network Settings. Step 5 Again tap on Reset Network Settings. On your phone Apple logo and loading bar appear, then your phone will restart. That's it. Now wait till your phone turn back on. After this, try to use Touch ID this is one of the ideal solutions for all time. Solution 4 Sign out and sing an Apple ID passcode to this, step 1 Open the settings app, and then step 2 Tap on the name label as you can see on my video screen, next step 3 Tap on sign out located on the bottom of the screen. Not fix the touch it issue. Now you will have to follow some strong action. Solution 5 Reset all settings on your iPhone, this will reset all settings on your phone or iPad. But don't worry, no data or media will be deleted. 
Follow the steps. Step 1 Open the settings app. Step 2 Scroll the screen and tap on general. Step 3 Next Scroll the screen. Tap on reset tab. Step 4 Tap on reset all settings. Step 5 Again tap on the reset all settings pop up and you're done. Now set up a new fingerprint and try to use it. To enroll fingerprint watch solution now that you watched in starting of this video. Still, touch it won't work. Let's check your software update as solution number 6 sometimes outdated software may behave some feature not work as we expected. Step 1 open the setting app step 2, then scroll the screen tap on general step 3 tap on software update. Make sure your phone is connected to a Wi-Fi network. If any update available please follow the on-screen instructions and update your phone firmware. Solution 7 rest finger to open step 1, open the settings app step to tap on accessibility find and tap on the home button now on the page, you find rest finger to open. Please turn toggle green. Solution 8 remove beta profile if you have any and downgrade iOS to install a stable operating system. Step 1 go to the settings app step to tap general step 3 scroll the screen tap profile step 4 click on beta profile certificate step 5 tap on remove that's it. Solution 9 Take your device to an Apple retail store or Apple authorized service provider, or contact Apple support if you can't earn on Touch ID or Touch ID setting is dimmed or grayed out last solution for those guys who addressing issue that unable to set up Touch it on this iPhone after screen replacement or battery replacement. Solution number 10 Let's listen to me carefully. Most likely when we replace the full display assembly, the main reason is the faulty Touch ID ribbon cable that is stuck up behind the LCD plate, in that case, you can take chances by replacing the new ribbon with the original ribbon cable. It might do a trick. In another case, if you've only replaced the LCD plate, then it seems like a part of the combination is damaged during installation, and Touch it is not working. Besides, if only Touch ID is not working after installing a new display, try swapping the original Touch ID or home button with the new. Sometimes, due to software restrictions, your device could not accept the new hardware, but replacing the old Touch ID is a good choice. Also, you can try restoring the iPhone prior to changing the screen, but take a backup of the iPhone and then restore and replace the display, for some people this technique did work. So you guys I hope this video information found helpful to you. Let's write in the comment on what solution worked for you. Please share this video and so needed people will reach easily on this troubleshooting guide. Thanks for watching, see you soon with a new video, goodbye. Have a nice day.